I want us to put our hands together. She's coming in her own way. She's going to minister to her, to us today. And I thank God. I thank God for her. We all know her. Stand on our feet. Let's praise God for the woman of God as she come. We know her. We love her. She's one of the child persons of our convention. We thank God. Come on for evangelist Dorothy Norwood. Come on. Come on. Let's praise God for the woman of God. There's no stardom in here. We thank. Come on. Clap your hands. Wake up. Put your hands together for the woman of God as she comes. We thank God for the word that's in her mouth. Come on. Somebody clap your hands and say, thank you, Jesus. I need everybody to play those instruments. I need everybody to play a little instrument. Make sure they're all on. Make sure they're all on. You can't test nothing this morning. It's too early to test. Praise the Lord, everybody. Come on, praise the Lord, everybody. Everybody praise the Lord. Come on, come on, let's, let's hear it for our bishop. Come on, let's hear it for our bishop. Come on, oh, is that all y'all got? Is that all y'all got? My good friend for many years, praise God, Bishop Albert Jameson. You may be seated. Now let me look at my watch. I have... This is a good watch, too. Three minutes after 10. He's told me three times. Told me on the phone. He told me earlier. He told me a while ago, 30 or 40 minutes. I'm going to try to 30. Praise God. Well, you know, um, I was uh, at a church one Sunday morning. Put me in the glass. I was at church one Sunday morning and I was getting ready to minister and the pastor called me in the office. He said, Sister Norwood, he say, let me ask you something. He say, when you come to preach, say, do you sing too? He said, I tell you why I said that. He said, because I had a very famous singer and preacher here and he told me when I asked him about singing, he told me, he said, look, and I look, look, Pastor, and said, when I come to preach, he said, that's one prize. And when I come to sing, you got to get a contract. <laughs> What's wrong with you? Don't play no track. I don't need no track. When I come to, when I, when I come to, come on, singers. And when I come to sing, you got to get a contract and pay me a deposit and give me the rest before I go on. He said, so I came to preach this morning. He said, what about you, Sister Norwood? I said, well, let me tell you something, Reverend. When I think of the goodness of Jesus and all he's done for me since I'm here, since this was a gift, I, I got some witnesses in here. I may as well sing and preach, so I'm just going to sing a little, because that get me ready to preach. Yes. That, that, that set the atmosphere. That all right? All right, all right. Victory is mine. I told Satan to get thee behind. Come on, come on, come on, clap those hands. Victory is mine. Victory is mine. Victory is mine. 
yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I tell you, I tell you, you got a good sound system up in here. This, this makes me want to sing and preach. Yeah. When you can hear yourself, huh? When you don't have to scream, scream your lungs out to hear yourself. You got it right, Bishop. God bless you. God bless you. But you know what? That song reminds me, because somebody in here need a victory. That song reminds me. That song reminds me of, of an, a song that, 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 that was meant the same thing. And I'm just going to sing, just chant a little bit. It said, tell me who will stand be us. I'm ready to have church in here a little while. When we call on that great name. Yes, sir. Blessed, blessed Jesus. Help me say, y'all, if you got it, help me say, we, we have the victory. My, my time, my time, my, my time might run out. My time might run out on this, but just turn around and slap somebody by the hand and tell them I got it. Oh. Tell somebody else, it's mine. Sometimes those songs are sung so fast until you don't get the message. But some told me to slow this down and say, In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. We have the victory. In the name of Jesus, I ain't gonna be long. In the name of Jesus, go to demons that hang around your door. Pull on your finances. Pull on your hair. Go to demons. They have to flee. One more time, and I'm through with this. Tell me, tell me, y'all. Tell me, tell me, tell me. Who can? working on somebody been through some real stuff feel yourself coming out it's working on you we have the Come to preach to no pitiful people. No depressed folk. I hope you got it. The victory. Hallelujah. In my bones. In my spirit. I hope you got it. That's the only thing about me. That's the only thing about me. I worry people. Because when I jump on those hymns, I can't get off. Sometimes I annoy people. When I jump on those hymns, I, I, I just can't get off. But I'm going to try to contain myself today. 
Put me in the I'm going to try to contain myself to death. Is it all right if I just sing one more line, one more chorus of one before I go into where I'm going? I sing great. I'm just going back down home where it started, where Dr. Watt started. Y'all know what they say. The side that say. I'm gonna I'm I'm be through. I'm gonna be through. Oh, right. Like me. Anybody saved in here? Don't move anybody saved in here. I'm gonna leave it alone because I'm gonna leave that alone because y'all, y'all, I see some folks sitting here, sitting here with their arms folded. I see some folks sitting down. What will love? Oh, help me, sir. Oh, now you can't tell me you don't know it. I'm fine. What fly? Watts wrote that song. Wonder why he said amazing grace. I wonder why the number one song in the country right now. Ricky Dillon saying amazing. I'm through. Y'all have a seat. I'm through. My watch. What's wrong with you? Now we're not going to turn this into a praise and worship service. Y'all can't. Y'all came to hear some preaching. We're not going to turn. All right, all right, all right. Let, let me, let me, I studied half the morning on this, on this, and y'all ain't gonna let me get it out? Look out, Bishop, look out, look out, Bishop. over and tell somebody anything you've been through this week. It's over now. Ah! It's all over. It, you may as well go on and praise him. You may as well, it's over now. You don't need no help. You don't need no help. Get it out! 
That's what I'm talking about. making it y'all y'all gonna make it hard for me because when you're on the mountain where can you go I'm already up here have a seat I'm gonna now have a have a seat have a seat look out look out don't you don't you don't you mess with me it's over now. It's all over. It's, it's all over now. It's over! Y'all don't act like it's over. You don't act like it's over. Anybody still depressed? Anybody still oppressed? Anybody in a mess? Don't you start, don't you start, don't you start, don't you start. Oh. What y'all doing back there? These just people. These just some overcomers. Don't look at them funny, they just some overcomers. All right, y'all have a seat. Let me get this. What you laughing at, Clean? My God, my God, I love you. I love you, Clean. Look, if he don't stop, because I'm thinking about some things that I've been through, that I went through. And it's over now! It's over I doesn't have anything to do with my message. I done sit and put on, my niece put on this iPad. You know, I got mine on, I wrote mine out. She got it on this iPad. It, and you know, with this iPad, it'll disappear. I'm, I'm sorry, I bought it for, it'll disappear. But I tell you what won't disappear. Right there, you, you. She started me. She, she the one. She the one started me. She came and sat down there and prayed for me, and got me ready. She put some in my spirit. Oh, Jean, Jean Bryan, really? Jean Bryan, Jean Bryan. All our friends gone on. Look at us. Look at us, Jean. Look at us, Jean. Oh, oh, oh! Lord have mercy. Look, 
Okay, now. The devil missed that assignment. He, he missed it. He missed it. He missed it. Okay. I don't know where to go now. I need, I need, I need. I, I need, I, I'm, 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 I'm putting my notes up and closing up my scripture because it's over. It's over! It's over! You, you can't have no victory until it's over. You can't shout until it's over. You gonna sit in your seat and look cute until it's over. You gonna carry a crown on your face. You gonna be depressed. Years ago, I got out of my bed when I heard that Pastor Jameson was in the hospital and fighting for his life. I got out of my bed and I went on my face. I didn't stop to my knees. And I prayed to God. It's over now. You keep saying that. You keep saying it. You, you receive it clean. Oh, Lord. I remember when Clean was this big. I remember when he was, look at him, look at him now. It's over. Okay. Okay, we, gonna, we ain't going to wear it out, y'all sit down. See, it's taking, it's, uh-oh. Look at my baby over here. Look, 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 look. Chipper. Look at Chipper. Chip. I kept calling. They say, they say, maybe he'll last through the night. Come and give me a high five. They say maybe he'll last through the night. I said, Oh my God. Love that boy. All that talent. You mean he getting ready to get out of here? I'm here. I'm here. I'm still here. The devil is a liar. The devil is a liar. God is, uh, God is exalted and the devil is defeated. It's over. Somebody go go out here and say, I knew she couldn't preach. I used to run revival for Jameson over there in Brooklyn. Somebody, some of some of my subjects was uh, so what? I had a bunch of them. I had a bunch of them. Uh, but he knows. But somebody gonna go say, uh huh. I can't. I came to hear preaching. She did not preach. It's over now. Yes, it is. That thing you've been struggling with. God has arisen and the enemy has been scattered. If y'all sit down, what I'm going to do is I'm going to try. 
I ain't going back in there. Somebody done took the Bible. All right, keep it, keep it, keep it, keep it, keep it. It's over, keep it. Keep it. Hold it. I don't have any major health diseases in my body, high blood pressure, diabetes, none of that stuff. I got a bad knee, but God left me uh, with a good knee, so when days come like this, I can say, I had to get that out. I had to get it out. Can I give a testimony now? Maybe that's the way I need to go. Six decades ago, almost six decades ago, I got a train to Chicago. Just keep playing a little longer. I got a train to Chicago because Singers kept coming through Atlanta. My mother had a singing group. I'll make it fast. My mother had a singing group, and everybody liked me. And uh, I went to Chicago because my cousin was with one of the Robert Martin singers. He, she married him. And I said, can I come stay with you? Because I had a vision. And I went to Chicago. My mom said, no, you need to get a good education under your belt. Say said, you are... Uh, you, you, you got a scholarship, two-year scholarship to Mars Brown. And you say, what the Lord may do in the next two years? Say, why don't you stay here? I said, no, Mom, I got to go. I got a vision. I got a goal to make. And I got on the train. She fixed me four pieces of fried chicken and uh, some pound cake and two packages of Kool-Aid and some sugar. I'm telling you what brought me to this place here today. And I got on that train and I went to Chicago. But the first night I got to Chicago, where my water, y'all took it away too? My water. First night I got to Chicago, Mahalia Jackson was singing over at 44th Street Baptist Church. Reverend Thurston, who's going to preach uh, after me, he's going to preach too. That man can preach. Uh, listen, he, uh, his granddaddy, Pastor John Thurston. It was his church, and Mahalia Jackson was singing there. Somebody sent a note up and said, there's a little girl from Atlanta, Georgia, that's here. Why don't y'all let her sing a solo? I sung a song called Just Tell Jesus. Tell him all. And, and when the service was over, I went up to shake Mahalia's hand, and some other people were in front of me. She said, don't you go nowhere. I want to see you. Oh, I'm getting to the good part, y'all. I said to myself, why do you think I came all the way to Chicago? She took me on the road, and I sang with her for about six months until, keep playing, y'all. Don't let the spirit die. This is, this, is, this, is, this is a shouting time for me. I sang with her six months. I had a little group. Oh, she always wanted me to lead the song. That little girl fights and let her lead the song. So anyway, I went back to Chicago and I was John Reverend Clay Evans Church. Anybody ever heard of Reverend Clay Evans? I'm talking about back in the 650s. I joined Reverend Clay Evans Church and I sang a song. I used to pass, I used to sing a song called Low is the Way. And everybody loved me singing that song. And one night at the broadcast, I got ready to sing Low is the Way, and, but who was standing in the back? She couldn't get no seat because he had a little small church at the center just getting started. Albertina Walker. <laughs> I'm getting to the good part, y'all. Honey, when I saw Albertina, I just I went to singing. I went all up the aisle. When service was over, she came to me. She said, 
hey, you want to go on the road and sing with the caravans? I said, yes, ma'am. I went on the road and sang with the caravans for about four years. After that, my mother got very ill, and my, all my sisters and brothers, they had gone. Y'all may as well hear this because y'all already shouted. My, 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 my sisters and brothers, they all had gone out and married, and I was the middle child, and I was still at home. I said, I'm, I have been saying, well, I don't know, I know how you feel about mama now. I left the caravans. I forgot about being famous. Let me tell you something. Do you know why the Lord has blessed me today? Because I took care of mama. Yeah. I got some witnesses in here. I said, if it's for me, I'll be famous later on, but I got to go take care of mama. I wasn't putting her in no home. Forget about a home. She had a check every month. The first of the month, we lived off that check. Because I couldn't work, I had to stay there with her. They amputated her leg, but I stayed there with her. I pushed in the chair to her doctor's appointments. And her health went down and down and down. And she eventually passed away. I had been getting up every night to see her because I would hear her in there crying. But one night I didn't hear her and I jumped up. I said, my goodness, she's sleeping good tonight. But she was in a coma. She had gone on to be with the Lord. Well, when I went back to Chicago, after the service, the caravans came in and they, y'all listen to this. They came and they sang at her funeral. But when I went back to Chicago, they had gotten Shirley Caesar. They, they didn't want me because I couldn't do it. They got in Shirley and Caesar. But the reason why they didn't take me is because there was no room in the car for me. Well, let me tell you something. You think I stopped there? I'm going to tell you what my subject was going to be. But I didn't get a chance to preach it today. Speak it till you see it. Speak, tell somebody, speak it. Speak it. Until you see it. You know, my text was going to be, you know where I was going with it? First Corinthians 2 and 9 said, Eyes have not seen. I wish I had another chance to preach this if we got to come back and be Ears have not heard, neither has it been revealed in the hearts of man. What God! Look at me standing here in my St. John. I feel like putting on the whole suit. But look, has in store for you them that love him. I love him. Well, I didn't have nowhere to get. Go then, because the caravans were going on on the road. So I one night, one day, Jesse Dixon was playing. I organized my group with my cousin and Lois Sneed and somebody else. And, and, and I laid the phone down and called Reverend, Reverend, I called Reverend Lawrence Roberts. I said, I got a group. He said, well, let me hear him. You see, everybody could go up and do those high, pretty notes pastor and all and I couldn't do that I couldn't do all of that but God gave me something to tell stories I got a witness I got a look at look at my baby there look at him Keith Pringle God bless you and I told a story called Johnny and Jesus then I told another one called a denied mother. Both of those songs got me gold records at that time. You didn't have to sell no million. But however many I sold, I was selling more than anybody else. And I got a gold record for those songs. And the rest is history. And here I stand today. 
But you know what? It, 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 I'm going to sit down in a minute because I'm going to sing just a little bit and I'm going to sit back down. But listen, check my watch. But listen, you know what? Things weren't good all the time. Because I got to New York when I had a drought in my career. I came to New York. Jameson used to let me come and preach. Pay me good, too. Let me come and sing. I love that man right there. Yes, he did. He Dati. Dati. That's what he called. Nobody called me like that. Dati. Come on over here to the tent. You know what I mean? But then uh, things got bad for me. And when things got bad for me, uh, I had the caravan to come to New York. And we sold out two concerts. But I, I had gotten a condominium, and the man that owned the condominium was financing for me. I got two or three months behind with him, and I got two. I had a Mercedes. I got me a Mercedes. I got two or three months behind it. I hid my car. Oh, ain't nobody hid their car. Nobody, nobody hid the car but me. Nobody, no, 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 no. Y'all ain't ever hid no car. Uh-uh, uh-uh, nobody hit the car but me. I didn't over eight more payments. They weren't going to get it. I'm preaching, y'all. I'm almost ready to receive this offering here. Honey, caravan sold out. And I had a man that owned a record shop that went in with me. He said, if you get the caravans here, he said, I'll... I promote it. I pay the money to promote it. Surely all of them came up there. We sold out friendship. Two back-to-back -back concerts. Huh? And do you know what? I, we had so much money after I paid the caravan. Money was stacked up on my table at the house. He came over there, money was stacked up. I counted money all night long. I went to sleep on the money. <laughs> But I kept one eye open. <laughs> Went to California and that's where I recorded Victory Is Mine. And the record companies that wasn't calling me back start calling me when I let them hear Victory Is Mine. Somebody prayed for me. Then I went on to shake the devil off. Hattie B's daughter. Here I am today. Give God some praise. Stand on your feet and give God some praise. And just shout out, speak it. Speak it until you see it. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you.